Holly Williams with ABCI. Uh, happy Wins Wednesday. Um, Wins Wednesday is kind of a practice that we do to check in once a week and uh, talk about what's going on that's good. And this is something that we encourage with all of our clients and in our community. And um, that is basically just to celebrate a thing or two things or three things. Um, that's going on that's good uh, in your life or in your business or in your practice or um, whatever it is that you do. And that also gives us a touch point with each other so that we can kind of check in and see how things are going and gives me an opportunity to maybe talk about some of the folks in our community that are doing really cool things um, that need a little extra publicity. So um, today's Wins Wednesday, I'm talking about two things. One is our um, aviation marketing lab. Uh, we have a new community that we've set up for that. And then the second thing is our Disney Magic Day, um, which we've set up for October, um, you know, just before the NBAA um, uh, Business Aviation Convention in Orlando, Florida. So first of all, our marketing lab is our group of clients, and we've always encouraged them to network with each other and uh, really cool things have happened in terms of partnerships and cooperations and referrals and uh, joint ventures and other things that are really amazing to me. It's just really neat when you get um, good people in the same room, uh, all of them involved with aviation in one way or another. A lot of people are working on the same problem from different angles and it's just really cool to see some of the interactions that happen. And we do that in person. We do that um, as much as we can uh, informally and things like that. Uh, and we've had for a number of years a Facebook group. But, uh, you know, there's a lot of folks in our community that are wary of Facebook and they don't want to be on Facebook or they just don't want it on their phone. They don't want to participate really in, in, uh, in that kind of ethos. And that's totally fine. I get that. Um, in fact, one of those people is my husband, John, who feels that Facebook is just not a great use of his time. And he also has security concerns because he's a security guy, uh, former military and so on. So I want to respect that um, from our community and give them an opportunity to network online in a way that makes them feel uh, safe and comfortable and not spammed or anything else. So we researched all of the software on the internet, um, you know, that had to do with online communities to look for something that met all of the criteria for this long shopping list that we had. Uh, and we looked at a lot of different things um, from the ridiculous to the sublime, as they say, um, from the free to the paid to everything else and stuff. And we came up with um, a product called Circle um, that's being used by Pat Flynn's SPI Labs and a bunch of other companies that we we know and respect and, and have used before. So um, I go through all of that in an article, you know, in terms of the pros and cons of each. So if you're interested in that, you're welcome to, to see it. But I'm excited about it because it gives us a place to gather as a community online that is private. It's not on Facebook. They are not collecting our information and using it for their marketing purposes or any other nefarious reasons. Um, it is our community only. There is no spam from outside groups or no spam from, from any other Facebook entities or anything else. Um, everything that you see in there is kind of curated uh, for our group. So it's not wasting your time with a bunch of um, other stuff that's, that's, extraneous to where we are. Uh, and then it's also everything in one place. So um, the one thing that I think that we do for our clients better than anybody else is help them spend their time in smart ways. Uh, there's a lot of information on the internet uh, about pretty much any topic that you want. And if you've ever looked for information about how to set up a Google account, how to set up a, a podcast, how to run a trade show booth. You know, there's a ton of information out there, but a lot of it is good, bad, ugly, and irrelevant, depending on where you're coming from. So, you know, the intention of this group is to curate a lot of that so that it's not wasting your time, because I know that's the most valuable thing that you've got as an aviation sales or marketing professional, helping you spend your time better is really what we're 
what we need to do, um, what I think is one of our most important jobs. So that's our online community. And if you are um, a client or a member of any of our groups, or if you're in, involved in any of our courses, you've already received an invitation to that. And we really look forward to interacting with you in that community. So that's thing number one. And of course, I'm posting this in Wins Wednesday on the community. So that's one of the features that I'm really going to enjoy is watching um, other people's Wins Wednesdays as well um, to see what you're doing and what you're up to. So that's thing number one. Thing number two is um, our Disney Magic Day. I am really excited to do something a little bit more interesting than our usual networking breakfast before uh, the NBAA convention. Typically, we have breakfast with our members the, the first Tuesday um, of that event. But we, what we wanted to do is spend a little bit more time together and do something that's a little bit more, uh, more fun and more meaningful and um, more useful, really. So we're partnering with Vance Morris with um, uh, Deliver Service Now as this company. Uh, used to be a Disney uh, representative, and uh, he's going to meet us at Epcot, and we're going to have dinner at one of the nicer Epcot Center restaurants, and uh, you know that'll kind of be our networking event. But then we're going to do a walking tour, a three or four hour tour of the Epcot Center uh, from the perspective of how can we market our business better, how can we create a better um, customer experience. How can we do some of the things that Disney has done so well for so many years? And, you know, regardless of the uh, recent controversy, Disney has always done a fantastic job of marketing and a fantastic job of keeping customers happy while raising their prices every year and, you know, weathering the pandemic and doing all kinds of things that are um, what we need to do. So, you know, sometimes we can learn from other companies and other industries things that we can apply in our own. So um, three or four hour walking tour, and then we're gonna end with fireworks um, at the Epcot Center. And uh, you know anybody who has spouses or kids or anything else, um, we've got some opportunities for some special deals so that they can uh, be in the park as well and then join us at the end for fireworks and um, dessert. So um, I always love food. I always love events incorporating food and I always love networking with our clients and customers. So if you'd like to be involved in our um, Disney Marketing Magic Day, do let me know. Um, we're taking reservations up until the end of June, sorry, up until the end of May only. So June 1st is the very last day to uh, reserve your space. Um, it's $600 for each aviation sales or marketing professional that wants to join us for that event, which includes dinner, the tour, and uh, and fireworks at the end. So anyway, I hope you'll join us, and I hope that we have um, a really fantastic time at Disney, and um, I'm really looking forward to seeing you there. Happy Wins Wednesday. We'll see you next week. <laughs>